Hey YouTube, uh, what's going on? Uh, I've had some problems with my stinking hose outside that's connected to a, uh, a hose reel and I went and bought uh, the hose connector, like I wanted to connect it and, and put a, a, a splitter valve in it for a soaker hose and one to go to my hose reel. Well I went and bought some of the the, the, the fittings and stuff, the connectors and stuff that you can buy, the female and the male connectors that you can buy, and they're held together by the clamps with the screws and stuff. Uh, Padula, something Padula makes them, and th this is what this is what I got. And I put them on the hose, and immediately it didn't work. I had them for the right size hose. People say, oh, you got to get for three quarter to five eighths. You know, I had it for the right size hose. It leaked. There was nothing you could do. It, it's just a garbage product. I don't know why they made them. I don't know. The other products that I got, I got a, a like it's a wand that you could tilt and you could put the different strain on. By that company, it works fantastic. I love it. it. You can get up in the plants and stuff. And you can put the head down. You can put whatever you want. Mist, whatever the heck you want. Works fantastic. So I was at uh, the home improvement store and um, I picked up one of these. It's, it's the male. The male hose connector mender thing, I don't know if it, it's reading that or not. Yeah, it's kind of reading it. But anyways, I picked those up, and I picked up a female heavy-duty mender. I picked up two of these, and uh, the, one of the females, and it had, a, it had a clamp on it. Well, I noticed that the ones that are aluminum, they don't hold very well. You've got to get a brass fitting and they work a lot better. But these fittings I have here to connect a hose to, you know, just to fix the end of the damn hose. I put them on there, really easy to install. No no screwdrivers, no nothing. And I, I, I put the ring on there, put it on that, tighten it up as much as I could. And then the nice thing is about the end one, it actually fits into that and you could tighten it up. And then when you want to connect it to something else, it actually rotates so you don't have to twist the hose. That's, it's just brilliant. So I was like, all right, not for the true test. Let's turn the water on and see it leak everywhere. Well, it didn't leak. It held like a champ. It works fantastic. No leaking anywhere. I highly recommend this product. Just, it works fantastic. I, I, this is the picture of it. It just works awesome. And if you ever uh, need a to put a fitting on there for the end of a hose, this is your product right there. And I know they make other fittings to, to connect a hose, like if you have a broken spot in a hose, like a split spot in a hose, or you run with a lawnmower, you cut a section out, and you can put the two together. I'm sure they work just as good. So if you ever want this product, if you this this product, I'm just just ecstatic that it it doesn't leak. Because all last year I had these on there and then it broke a couple days ago and I was like just pissed off and I didn't do anything. Or about a week ago and I was pissed off and I didn't do anything. I just heck with it. I'll wait till the weekend to get the parts. I went and got the parts, seen these. They were a little bit more expensive. I think they were like $7. Were they $7 a piece? They're like $7 for each one. But I'm telling you what, it's, it's worth it because you ain't gonna have any leaks and it works really well. For me at least, if it doesn't work for you, you're doing something wrong because it's really easy to fix. So uh, that's about it. Go out and get yourself some uh, some some fittings by order. Thanks for watching.